Metal December. How it's made. Today on how it's made. Magnets. Now, magnets go from north to south in a matter of seconds. You could say they're the poles apart. Whoa! Whoa! Ho -ho! We. I, I am alarmed that you had such a zinger so early on, and now I fear we will have no more zingers. I hope not. Oh my, oh my god. Wow. That's floating in midair. How have they done that? With magnets. That's how. So, first of all, they have the gold. I, I, it's like horseshoes, gold horseshoes. They put it in the sploncher and it turns to powder. Now, I think they might be making chocolate. I hope so, because magnets are boring, but chocolate is yummers. But it's not made of metal. Oh dear, we've ruined Metal December. Shit. Ruined. N nonetheless, we will continue, and they have made four delightful horseshoes in the bottom of the chocolate box. I hope they're going to make magnets with these. Well, I, I can't promise anything, but wow. Now this is metal, that's a good sign. Yes, it's a metal December. There's some cheese in a tub, and some shards of metal, and some blades, and some foil. They put the shards in the cheese and give it to the enemies. Yes, it's very easy to hide in the cheese and then invite them over for cheese on toast. So they put all the metal into a tiny furnace. It is, it's, it's one of the tiniest furnaces in the world. And they have the, they're in the Guinness records for that. Whoa, be careful. It's hot. Hot stuff coming through. It's 2G33. Lock up your daughters. Oh shit, they've gone wrong, they've set it all on fire. Oh my goodness, what a waste of time. Throw push it away. In, throw that one in the bin. Throw it in the bin, push it away. There they go. There it goes. Start over. What a disaster. And, uh, they have to break it all up just to stop it burning. They've actually messed it up completely. They have to smash it up to smithereens to get it out of there. But finally, they can plop it in front of a fan, cool it off, and and salvage whatever hasn't been burnt. Which just so happens to be magnets. Oh yes, the north and the south, you can clearly see defined there. Now, this is a lot of magnets stuck together with glue to make a stick, and they put it into a chimney. It's a very fun process. And then Johnny here, he puts it. And with some sand, and the sand gives it its sandy appeal. Yes, and Johnny has very cool glasses, uh, but they also protect his eyes from the sand. They're functional glasses, but they look very fashionable, and Johnny is pleased with these glasses. Yes, he, he had to save up all his money for seven years. Yes, but it was worth it. He just sealed the sand inside its, its tomb, and then he put it into the glow zone. Now he's got to be careful here, Johnny, because he might die. That is so dangerous. What are you doing, Johnny? Oh my god, don't touch that. I mean, if you drop that on your leg. Ouch. He doesn't get paid enough for this job. I know, man. He, he had to. Did you hear he had to save for seven years just to buy his glasses? Well, they're pretty cool glasses. They're very cool glasses, but still seven years is a long time. Check the vaults. We've got six. That's, that's amps. The amps are six, the vaults are off the scale. Oh shit. Mamma mia. Out mm. comes the magnets. Woohoo! Just as he put them in, nothing has changed. Then this time he gives it a proper sanding instead of just giving it sand. Yes, and he uses a special little circular little circuit. Oh. Well, that's failed. It doesn't it in, work. Doesn't stick work. it in the bin. Mm. We've been in a lot of stuff today absolute disaster. But wait, he's putting it on here. Wait, well, oh, that looked powerful. It might work now. Do you know why he has such a mighty moustache? Because it's such a manly job. What he does. Making magnets? Yeah. Flicks them amps up, flicks them bolts up. You got a magnet. Bob's your uncle. 
Magnets come in many, many forms. My favourite is the old north-south poles apart divider. But a cog's nice. These bits and pieces. Bits and bobs.